If somebody told you that you can't wash your locks, they lied to you. Hi guys, it's India Nicole and welcome to my channel. If you haven't already done so, go ahead and push the subscribe button below and let's get right into this lock video. So as you guys read from the title, I will be showing you guys how I do a simple wash day because I am going to get a retwist later, so I want my scalp to be fresh. And um, it's not too long. Um, you just get right into it. <sighs> I have been waiting to take that down, <laughs> y'all. My hair is a mess, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't washed it in about two, three weeks and she is screaming for some attention like i don't even know what's going on right here all right so i took my hair down and you can either do this one or two ways since my hair unravels i am going to do the method where you twist it first and then i'm going to go in with the, some acv and water um or you can do it reverse however you however you want because my hair definitely is going to unravel and not that i'm too concerned because like i said i'm getting a retwist later <laughs> But in the back, since she is kind of holding up, y'all see me? She kind of do a little something, something. I just do chunky twists, like not too concerned with the back because I think she's going to hold up well. If you guys have any tips on unraveling other than <laughs> it's going to happen, please let me know because I just don't think the front wants to do this. ACV and water um you want to make sure you dilute it really good you don't want that ACV to be too strong on your hair and use a towel because this crap is strong and really you don't want to just do it too much just kind of get your scalp and rub as you go not really focusing on the other ends of my locks because I will do the detox bath Maybe like a six months or when I see like a lot of build up. But I don't use too many products, so we'll see. But I really do want to focus on the very front of my hair because like I said, um it is super flaky in there. And I'm also gonna be doing a video on how I get rid of that um in between my wash days. And I'm going to let that marinate for about 10 15 minutes.
as much as I thought like even on this one that I had no hope for so we're getting somewhere all right so we're gonna do kind of a semi hot oil treatment and my hair is still pretty damn so I don't need to put any rose water or anything in there we're gonna be using the African healing oil and I love this brand I've discovered her on YouTube I don't know I do use another one of her products um, when, I go ahead and do my, when I do my routine my wash so I'm gonna be honest with y'all before y'all come to ghetto I was going to go out and get a shower cap and pretend like I don't use my grocery bags, but I do. So this has been heated up and you just go in and oil your scalp really good. And I use a generous amount. I did have one of the deep conditioning caps that you put in a microwave for like a minute or so and then you um, go ahead and put it on your head but my hair got too big for that thing so I'm gonna just go ahead and purchase a steam cap this time so I can stop being ghetto <laughs> but if you know you know Either way, using the bags and then putting on a bonnet will trap in some of the heat and the oil is already hot. So, works for me. And really what this does is lock in some of that moisture that you may have lost in the washing process. I'm trying to hang it up while it's still hot. All right. <laughs> And then you put the bag on. Like, there's no way to be cute about this. You put the bag on. Then you put another one on for good measure. Just kind of tuck that bad boy in there. And then you put on a bonnet. And, and I got this super cute bonnet. Well, my husband got it. And it is black owned and a woman owned. And Texas owned. Okay. Let me just tie that twice. And put that on. And you just let her marinate. And you don't have to wash this out. Um, I'm not going to take this off until I am in the parking lot before I go get my hair done. And you just, like I said, you just let this be. And y'all tell me down below. I feel like you can wear this out in public as like a little turban. I think it's cute enough to do so. But that is it for this video. That is how I do my simple wash day. Now, if you haven't subscribed already, please go ahead and do so so you can see more videos like this from me in the future and have a good day.